What's going on guys, Dylan from theboxerrockers.com with a brand new video on how to move over your iTunes library, music files, everything, to a new computer, or if you restore your computer, how to back it up and move it over. Uh, it can be a hard process if you make it a hard process, or it can be really easy, and I'm going to show you the easiest way that I know after having a look when I had to move to my new computer. So, basically, if you have your files stored in like a music folder, like outside of the actual music folder, or where iTunes default like stores them by default, then it can be kind of a hassle. But however, if it automatically copies to the folder where you add them, or if you bought all your songs on iTunes and not like, you know, downloaded them or use some other retailer, then it can be a hassle. So basically, all you need to do is open up iTunes. Go to File, go to Library, Organize Library, click Consolidate Files, and then click OK. Give it a few seconds, maybe like five, and a window should pop up. It will start copying over all your files to the iTunes uh, folder. Now, if it automatically does it, or if you've already done it before and you haven't added any new songs, then it will do what it did for me, and it won't move. It won't move anything over. Um, and then you know you're good. But do give it a few seconds because sometimes it can take a minute to realize like what all it needs to copy. So once you're done with that, you can close it, go over, open up your music folder, and then what I did is just copy my whole music folder and move it over to the external hard drive, move it over to the new computer via Wi-Fi, whatever you need to do. And then once that's ready, you install iTunes. Uh, then you're going to delete everything out of the music folder that's already there without uninstalling iTunes then move over everything from your old music folder into the music folder uh, on your account and then you go into the iTunes folder and you'll see iTunes library you'll basically see make sure that it was, it's the newest one like it was made whenever you backed up your files or whenever the last time you opened iTunes was and then you click it, and it will open up your iTunes exactly how it was, with everything ready and everything going and working. So that's about it. Thanks for watching. Uh, if you have any questions, just comment or message us. Um, you can check us out at theboxrockers.com. You can follow us on Twitter, at BoxRockers. And you can also get our official Android app for free on the Android Marketplace. Just search BoxRockers. So thanks for watching, and until next time, see ya.